Guys, I just wanted to pop in here with a quick apology. The uh, microphone I used for this one was not great. I did return it, but I used it plugged into the camera, so I didn't really have another option. It sounded like I had backup audio. So just please endure. Thank you for understanding. Better audio in the next video. I'm going to show you how to make crystal clear ice. I bought a couple things from Amazon. This, these, and this. And here's how I do it. I'll rate these as we go, and then we'll see what you think has the best ice. Here's the old school way. You just put it in a cooler. Obviously, it freezes down, directional freezing. You've seen it a thousand times. This is the way I usually do it. And now, uh, let's get the first one out. You can do this. <laughs> You can do this on a sink or at a sink at your house, but mine's over there. So I have recruited an old storage pan. As you can see, ooh, just coming right apart. Mostly pretty clear, some little bubbles in there, but it's a solid piece. I'll set that aside. And the next one, same idea, but I put little ice trays in it. I don't do this one, I don't do this too much, but I, I don't know, I like just carving the ice. It's therapeutic, as long as you don't have little weak girl hands that get cold at the touch of ice, holding it for a long time. They're like, well, how come you're not focusing on this one? Cause you gotta let it temper. It'll make sure the ice just doesn't crack as soon as you touch it. I'm on. I don't know if doing this does anything, but I like to feel like it does. <sighs> See, this one will give you the cubes right off the bat. And sometimes they don't form correctly. Sorry, you just gotta chop at them. Just give them a little chop chop. Choppity chop chop. Now, here's the ice from the tray. Put little holes in the bottoms of the tray so it can freeze down. Now I didn't do it perfectly, which is why the ice isn't perfect, but it's pretty damn good clear ice. With this one, you just kind of take it, carefully shave all the whatnot off. Shave all the nonsense and all that off. Now that it's nice and tempered, you can see that it's pretty clear. You can cut this to size. So you wanna have a good like inch or so. Whoop. A good like two inches. Score it, score it. Get, a, get yourself a nice serrated knife or, like I did, and saw. <laughs> Once you kind of get in there and you feel like you're at a good place, I suggest get just doing it once around the whole way just to be sure. Now with this, you can really just cut through the whole way, but then you're holding it, your hand gets all cold. You don't want to do that. So just give it a once around. It doesn't really matter if it matches up perfectly or not. Then get a mallet. Find the place where you've been scoring. Clean split. And then you can shave these down into cubes as you see fit. shave it if you want it down to a specific size. Now you have your own homemade. Your own homemade ice right there. Homemade ice from scratch. 
and then you just kind of do that with the rest of your stuff here. Kind of start it with that knife. And you run it through with your little handsaw. This thing was what, like 20 bucks on Amazon? Yeah, it has changed my ice game. Forever. But yeah, they don't have to be perfect. A lot of this stuff is gonna end up being used for shaky ice. And, uh, but it does go in drinks. And people will always ask, why do crystal clear cubes? What's the, what's the point of it? Well, I personally believe aesthetics matter. You taste a drink with your eyes. You taste a drink with the perception of it before it even touches your lips. And it dilutes slower because it doesn't have to go through all the pockets of air bubbles and all that stuff. So it's just better. So I'm gonna go ahead and carve the rest of this up. Then we'll get to the ones I got on Amazon. Now the first one we got from Amazon is this little tray. It looks like it's the same basic gimmick. I don't wanna break the damn silicon. Come on, out with you. Yeah, same basic gimmick. This thing is just filled with water. Set that off to the side. And let's just see how the ice turned out. That's obviously why we got it, because I want clear ice. Hmm. Not, not a great first cube. Let's see the next one. Oh, no, that's still all watery. Oh boy. I put these in for the recommended 24 hours and not a single cube came out. I'm gonna try it again. Maybe leave it for like 36 and maybe we'll get actual cubes, but I don't know. Uh, future sin here, and I do know it still did not turn out right. One cube grew and like took water from the rest of them. Yeah, overall, not not really worth it. Do not get, or do get if you don't know. You can. Don't listen to me. I'm just a guy who had it. All right, next to Amazon ones. These are supposed to be spheres. And again, uh oh, already not a good omen. I put them in for 24 hours. And now I know this one works. I've used this one, but apparently it needs to cook a little bit longer. So I'm gonna put it back in the fridge. Let's try the other ones. Let's try this one. Oh, hey, hey, that's all right. That's big fancy. Ice diamonds. Can you even see that on the camera? Yeah. Those aren't bad. And these ones are a little special. Little special. Ice hearts. You have a date with a little lady and you want to go, hey, Gorgeous, here you go. Ice hearts. The heart is melting in my hand. Your heart, she melt. So we got nice little ice hearts and ice diamonds and cubes over there in the freezer. Thankfully, I had an ice sphere in the freezer that did work. We just took the thumbnail, I forgot about these ones. These are little roses. I mean, they're not clear. You can see all that shit in the middle of it. But they are roses. Technically. I got other videos to record after this, so I'm gonna use these in the spears that didn't freeze right as the shaky ice. I think if anything is to be taken away from this, know your freezer better than any instruction manual ever will. All of these said, 24 to 48 hours, or I'm sorry, 18 to 24 hours. I put these in the freezer yesterday at about 2 p.m. and it's seven o'clock now, so clearly they needed to be in there longer. 
but all of them do end up with clear ice. The molds cost more than a cooler does and takes less work, so it's up to you. If you guys like the channel, have any questions on anything you've seen, any requests, let me know. Leave a comment down below, like, share, do all that stuff YouTube likes, and I'll see you in the next one.